I wish I knew about this earlier. So you know how when you're making the bark block for Minecraft you use that? So I put in a stack, I only got 40 out, but if I go over here to the woodcutter, place it in, I could get a stack. Oh, I'll be doing it all wrong. All wrong this whole time. But well, welcome everyone back to Liam's world. My name is Zombie Liam, you look up on it under dirt here. And in today's episode, I think I want to start working on the tree, build it up a little bit. Um, yeah, and I have crafted quite a lot of the, the wood. So we, I don't think I'll be running out of wood today, but just in case it should be easy enough to get some more. But yes, let's go ahead and start working on the tree, getting it high. Okay, I kind of realised um, in episode 2, I didn't really explain how i done this stuff. Like the wood placement, so what I do is I just go like this, place it down, I make sure I'm placing it down the way, and then I'm just pillaring up a few blocks. But I'm also going to go ahead and change around some things, because stuff like this happens, and... I, I'm not wanting stuff like that. So I just go through, cut over, and that looks a bit better. However, I'm not too sure. I'm not very good at trees. I'm going to have to wait till I do more to touch up, I guess. Okay, so I think I've got to the height that I want like the rest of the trunk to go. I guess I'm now ready to start doing the all of the branches and all of the leaves and stuff like that. I don't know if I should take it out or if I just leave it and then do the branches. I don't know if that's going to look a bit silly. But I don't know, I kind of like it. I feel like maybe like this bottom bit looks a bit weird. I don't know if it looks too flat, if that's what the issue is. But yeah, maybe if I just carve like this back, it'll make the tree look just ever so slightly better. Uh, no. I was wrong. Basically, I took a day to look over what I've done and to reconsider I got some help off some other people, including Frolash, who they said you can cut down the top of the tree and then make it go higher and that will look better. So that is what I'm planning to do right now. No! Oh no, I can't believe it, I died? Damn, this, this is even more dangerous than what I think it was going to be. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is, um, I asked a couple of people for feedback uh, about the tree, and I got some pretty good advice, actually. A couple of people said, oh god, here we go again. Oh. Okay, so, a, a person said I should chop down the top of the tree, and then build it up again, but this time... Focus on the height, other than the try to get like thin and stuff like that. So just make it go higher more than thinner. So I'm going to try that. Not again! <laughs> oh my god, this is looking a hundred times more better already. I can't wait till we start doing the branches for this now. Yeah, man, I can't wait to do the branches. It actually looks like a proper tree now. 
I just want to say a big shout out to Flowlash for giving me the idea of taking it halfway and then making it go up. Because it actually looks really good now and I'm super happy with this. Super happy. Okay. I'm here back on the ground because I want to try see if I could find the location of the deep dark city I believe that's what it's called and I think what I'm going to do is um, I think I'm just going to go a bit mining around these little areas around here try to see if I can find it I know there's oh, there's not a 100% chance for like this to have a deep dark city in it but it'll be cool if I can find one Okay, now this, this is a spooky cave. <laughs> what is that block under there? Oh, that's just deep blue. Oh. Okay, I've not found the thing yet, but I have found a, another spawner. It's a skeleton spawner, which is cool. So that's like my fourth or fifth skeleton spawner I found, and... Oh, we got a new disc and stuff. Oh, that was my first, um... Huh. That was my first ever for sure. Nice. Hey! I just randomly bumped into diamonds. That's awesome. We got 17 more diamonds. That's actually pretty good. Wow. Okay, I just... I just looked at this and realised I wasn't recorded. So this is the geode from episode 2. Uh, we got all this stuff by the way, except from the wooden stuff. Um, there's a spawner here. This is a spider spawner. And if I kill a spider, these things are going to spread. This is interesting. I've still not found this stupid thing yet. I've been searching for about an hour, but I'm not going to give up the shit. Were those diamonds there the whole time? And I just missed him. The whole time. Oh, I'm such a noob. Yay, another spotter. Uh, yay. Okay, so I just found like a new massive cave. Attached to the other cave I was just in. So I think I'm going to explore this and see all the resources I can get with it. Yes. More diamonds. Thank you. Hey buddy, how's it going? I don't have much for you today. But hopefully that's fine. Uh, I'm breaking, we don't need them breaking, which is fine. We are... Thank you. Thank you for your... Your stuff, my guy. Really appreciate it. Yay! Okay, this is getting quite interesting now. I'm finding so much more of the, like, deep dark city stuff. So, I think I could be close. Diamonds! Diamonds! Both one bins. That's fine, that's fine. <gasps> okay, I'm mining to try to see if I can find a deep dark from the area that I found before and I just found more diamonds and we're up to 18 diamonds right now. That's that's awesome. Okay. I found it. Oh, there's a chest right there. I am going to quickly loot that chest. And then I'm going to leave Fallen Kingdom. Find an ancient city. There's two chests here. Let's see. Okay, this is some good stuff. Um, I can't pick it all up just now. Fire protection free. Silk touch book. Yo. Yeah, th this is some good stuff. So, um...
Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I will be back later on. There's skeleton skills and everything. There's diamonds there. Okay. Okay, we're leaving. Goodbye. I'm actually um, going to make a staircase up. Which is heading towards zero zero, so we can get here easily. And we are back home. Nice. And I have gathered everything that we have mined in this chest for over the last two hours. Ga gathering this stuff. I think it's pretty good to have an extra speed bomb book. 35 diamonds. That's a lot of diamonds. So in total we have 36 diamonds. Although I think definitely next episode I want to take on that bash. And however I want to be in full diamond armor for that. And I want to have a diamond sword. So yes, we have a bit of work to do before we do that. But I think I'm ready. We're on, we've got four diamond horses, which is awesome. And yeah, we also need to do something about the storage. I think that's going to be something I do soon, because I want to make a little storage room at one point. It's got too many chests everywhere. But yeah, I think we've done a lot of work to do on the tree. I'm, I'm happy with it. It looks a bit weird at the top, but I'm sure it'll look better once I... I do a bit of work to it, maybe, I'm not sure. But thank you guys so much for watching the episode, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye! Of course, it starts raining.